My drawing is um, a tree, and in the clouds are ways that trees and um, trees can help the environment and how it can be useful to us. It's like so far up there, you know. Can't well, wait. Well, how's everybody doing? Okay. <laughs> oh wow! Look at that. Huh? So you got the second place one time. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Doran School. Okay. How's everybody doing? All right. Good. Very good. So. I was told that the students had the opportunity to do some drawings for Arbor Day. Is that right? How many of you got to do a drawing for Arbor Day? Excellent. Well, <laughs> say, Cheyenne, you did. Why don't you just show it? Cheyenne. So I'll turn it over briefly to Liz Dennehy and Mary Ann Mordell to tell us about the contest and tell us a little more about Arbor Day. And then what I would like to do is I have these citations to hand out uh, to three recipients. I'd like to make that presentation too. So, Street Tree Planting Program has hosted similar contests in the past, uh, but this is our first year doing it. And we're very impressed with the responses that we received from the city's fifth graders. And all of the artwork that was received was really fantastic. And I will turn it over to Marianne to talk a little bit about the judging of the contest and a little bit more of the history. Okay. Well, I've been with the um, Fall River Street Tree Planting Program for 18 years, and I have a big love of trees. And I thought it would be very nice if we uh, had an art contest to hopefully inspire children to uh, foster love of trees also. Trees give us so many benefits and um, one of the ways that we wanted to impress uh, students is to talk about the benefits. And um, Arbor Day was first celebrated. Does anyone know what year it first began, Arbor Day? Somebody, anybody? Okay. You may know Want to try? <laughs> Teacher? I, I actually <laughs> did a whole PowerPoint on it for them. Yeah. And we talked about trees. I actually forgot the year. Okay. <laughs> it was in 1872. And it was started by uh, a man who had moved to Nebraska. And he missed all the trees in his native state. So what he did was plant one million trees that first year. And of course, then he didn't miss his trees in his home state anymore. But um, we're very glad that we had such a great participation. We love uh, the submissions by the uh, students. And I would like to thank uh, the three judges. Uh, there were David Mello, some of you may know from the uh, library, and a good friend, Everett Castro and a member of the um, tree planting program, Leo uh, Lafleur. So, is it all right if we announce our winners? I have the uh, well, citations say, say. as the tree lady here <laughs> in the city of Fall River. And how many of you know where Bay Street is in Fall River? Anybody know where Bay Street is? <laughs> Go down on Bay Street, what you're going to see there is the Mary Ann Wardell Tree Farm named after Mary Ann Wardell. And we've been very fortunate to establish a tree farm in the city of Fall River. So we're taking trees, planting them as babies, growing them, and then moving those trees out into the city. So if you want a tree planted in front of your home, you can have that done. And you contract the Fall River Street Tree Planting Association, and they can actually go and help you plant a tree in front of your home. So. Arbor Day is a big deal to me and Mary Ann, and it's a big deal to all of you because you've got to participate in it. And to all of the artists, I say thank you for giving us this beautiful artwork to hang in at Government Center, and I know you all tried really hard on it, and I appreciate all the work that you have done. And hopefully next Arbor Day, uh, you can come back here and do it all again. So we have uh, three we have a third place, a second place, a first place, and an honorable mention. 
Do you want me to say the names or do you have them too, Mary Ann? I have the names. But Why don't you go ahead and say them? Okay. Why don't we start with the honorable mention? We, we want to start with honorable mention. Yeah. And that goes to Talissa Cabral from Green School. So Talissa's here. Mm -hmm. And thank you so very much. Thank you, Talissa. That's for you. And congratulations. Now why don't we do... To Haley the, from the Doris School. Haley. Congratulations. There you go. Now second place. Second place. Second place goes to Cheyenne from the Doran School. Cheyenne. That's for you. And first place. Goes to Hannah Souza. Hannah. She here? Yeah. Hannah. Great job. That's for you. Congratulations on first place. Can we get a picture of all the kids together in front of the... Uh... Hey, you got your citations? Turn them out so we can see them. There we go. Perfect. You just smile at all. <laughs> <laughs> so again, congratulations. Do you have fun doing the artwork? Good, I'm glad. Glad we have fun hanging it. And uh, all the citizens who walk through this car will get to see your artwork. So make sure you bring your friends and family out of the government center and show them that you're a published artist now here at government <laughs> center, okay? Thank you, everybody. Thank you. Congratulations again, guys. Oh, you're kidding. Thank you, Marianne. You're welcome. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you again. Thank you. Thank you.